Hey friends, welcome back to another video. It is Tuesday for me and it's about that time where I'm getting uh, dinner ready. Just got back from doing laundry. I got some Mexican rice going on, some chicken thighs. Gonna make this box of mashed potatoes for dinner. So let me know friends what you guys are making for, for dinner today. What are your plans? What did you guys have for dinner? I also have these packets of brown gravy i picked up three from grocery outlet that's what's for dinner here at my humble home my friends and here is my face friends sorry i look rough but it is pretty hot here in my kitchen as you know we that well we're in summer and uh, today we're supposed to be like 110 one something like that and I'm cooking so obviously it's hot in here but I just wanted to go ahead and get it out of the way thank you so much for clicking on this video if it's your first time thank you so very much please don't forget to subscribe if you like this kind of content um, or just hit that like button if you like this content friends it really helps me out I'm so happy that you are here and I hope you enjoy this video um, here at my humble home you will see a lot of homemaking motivation on a budget or real stuff here um, Christian homemaking encouragement for our soul amen because um, who doesn't need encouragement for our soul especially these hard times friends um, so yeah friends let me know how you all doing and I'm so happy so thrilled that you clicked on today's video and um, God bless you my friends so this is what my mashed potato looks like. Added some butter, milk, shredded cheese, pepper, um, butter. This is what my ch uh, chicken thighs look like. I added the the packets, the gravy packets, brown pack, brown gravy in here. I added. I ended up adding some carrots just so we can have some kind of vegetable in there gonna let them soften and this is what my Mexican rice looks like it's been a while since we had this still in the kitchen almost finishing up friends got my living room dark in here this is my clothes my daughter helped me put away and my son here is my other pile this is more like uh, the work clothes of my hubbies need to be put away in hangers and some towels this was the money that was left from washing i wasn't even filming and here's boston he brought his toy that's his little toy over there oh my how about you? yes huh oh <laughs> so cute he gets so happy so I picked up this cute uh, Walt Disney Sleeping Beauty. <sighs> it says one of the world's best love stories because Walt Disney's newest most wonderful motion picture. This is a cute bag that I picked up at the flea market last weekend that I was there uh, for a dollar and I thought it would have been it's gonna be good for my quarters so when I go do laundry show um i wanted to share with you guys uh my tea finished and i know teas right now just to think about it it's a warm and hot outside but my husband likes to have these in the morning with a cup of coffee before he goes off to work um he picked up the spearmint tea which is te de yerba buena cinnamon tea te de canela Another spearmint tea, te de hierbabuena. A lemon tea, te de limon. Te de canela. Let me know how you guys make these just cold. If you guys do or do you guys have them hot. Um, I really would want to enjoy them with cold and ice. I don't know if that's possible. I've never tried it. Let me know if you all have and let me know in the comment section how you guys make yours. I also needed to buy a new can opener that I picked up at Grocery Outlet. 
for a $4.99. The other one that I have was already not working. So I already tossed that one already in the garbage. I also washed my dishes. Oh, and let me tell you, friends. Um, this is a new addition that um, my son Nathaniel's girlfriend, Rack, um, blessed us with. Her sister moved out. So she blessed us with this a new microwave for us and we've been enjoying it and i love it and it's perfect for my counter mm -hmm. and um it's just so nice to have a microwave now we can have leftovers warm them up without making it complicated because before we would use the oven on my stove but now we got this microwave and it is perfect the size and everything i think it looks great there in um the counter space perfect size as well I have plenty of room around so I just love it and I'm thinking I'm going to be cutting this in a bit and serving Boston and my other dog uh, that I have outside and but he's gonna enjoy this so I just decided to go ahead and put the leftovers away already and clean up the rest of my mess here so here is the chicken thighs with the brown gravy and carrots and this is the rice i can't find my lid to this container so foil paper will have to do now i'm gonna get hey guys i also too i just some right here and we got lots of water pressure now they finally fixed our well outside the one i showed you guys on the previous video I also, they also changed my faucet out which i love they also uh, changed it off the one in the restroom and the sink area and i'm so loving it and i'm just gonna go ahead and wash these dishes Hey friends, I came out with my daughter over here. My son's over there. He's doing a little workout. Got outside the house. And he, I wanted to take to um, put in some steps. But friends, I did a lot of steps I think today. And I'd be pushing myself really. But it's nice. There's not that many people. Well, n nobody really out here right now. I think because of the heat still. But there's plenty of shade here. Here, let me turn you guys around. You can see there's hardly, well, there's nobody out here except us. But I love all this greenery. I just love what they did. And it's just like where we live, we live like on that side. And this is this side. There's my son, Jonathan, over there gonna get a workout brought our waters hear the birds chirping so cute 